Hi guys, we're going to be sharing a myth with you guys in regards to the back foot lifting up on the serve. Okay, traditionally being told that oh, you got to really lift that back foot up in order for you to get more power on the serve. Because you're jumping up and then you're going to rotate and hit the ball and then you're going to lift that foot back up. Guys, it's not compulsory to lift that foot that high. Okay? As the main key ingredient for speed on the surf is really racket head speed and I'll demonstrate with you guys and you'll see that I don't force my leg back up that high okay now what happens is the foot might come up from all the power that you push upwards but the focus is going upwards and rotating up towards the ball but not just simply lifting the back leg traditionally many friends have been told to force the leg up but really they don't get the effect because the focus is not really there so as you guys can see in my demonstration which is just now which is going to be happening now that I don't over lift the foot up but the leg does come up but it's through all the action that I push upwards as I rotate up towards the ball resulting in acceleration of the racket head into the ball so as you guys can see my leg does come up but I'm not really forcing it up, but my focus is really going up towards the ball and rotating upwards so that my racket head snaps at the ball. It's very important that you guys see the distinction, the difference between the two, because it's where your focus is. So if you guys can ignore the myth of lifting the foot back up huge to get that power into the ball, that's a myth, but rather to go push upwards and rotating up towards the ball strong, and the leg will eventually come up. So be sure to notice to distinguish the difference between the two and I guarantee you guys a more powerful serve.